Hey guys, so I recently did a drop test on my Huawei P9 and you can see uh, it works fine, okay, uh, but the display is cracked. So uh, I want to give my honest opinion about this phone, uh, if it's worth your hard earned money or not. So first of all, uh, if we talk about the price, this one costs around $500 uh, for 3GB RAM variant, uh, which also offers 32GB of Intel storage. So I think uh, that is pretty affordable. $500 is actually pretty, pretty affordable for a high-end smartphone. Uh, I mean, uh, like I said in my previous video, that this is the most affordable flagship phone of 2016. The, uh, the reason why I said that is because it's costing less compared to phones like Galaxy S7 or iPhone 6S, you know. Uh, the S7 costs around like, uh, what you call, it's around uh, 70 thousand PKR you know it depends if you get the official variant so yeah this one costs less and uh, it's actually worth the money I mean it, it is Huawei of course it's not Samsung or Apple so you don't get that uh, status feeling out of this phone but uh, yeah I mean it offers everything pretty much everything like the uh, stuff you get from the S7 you know uh, so you can see the build quality is really top-notch camera is pretty great uh, it's pretty nice camera actually really good uh, color accuracy uh, I probably watched some comparison that I did uh, so I also did a comparison with the s7 I mean it's really good it does a better job compared to s7 in um, sunlight you know when you're doing outdoor uh, pictures uh, but just that it's not as good as the s7 when it comes to a low light situation but again uh, not a lot of people uh, capture photos in low light. They like to capture photos in uh, in a bright, you know, bright environment. Uh, so yeah, uh, it has a nice front camera, eight megapixel. Uh, of course, it's offering a 1080p display, but it's a really bright display, and most people will be okay with this display, you know. And uh, yeah, other than that, it has Kirin 955 chipset. The battery life is great, uh, giving me around four to five hours in between skiing on time. So I have to say it is worth the money. I mean, it's definitely worth the money uh, for $500. I don't think so that you can get that much of a good smartphone, you know, obviously uh, around this price, I think the Note 5 uh, is available, cost a little bit more, uh, but it is around that price point. So Note 5 is also a great phone. Uh, but again, uh, that phone is a 2015 phone. This is a 2016 phone. So yeah, that's that. I hope you guys have uh, enjoyed this video. And also, I hope uh, this video helped you out. And uh, like this video. And peace out.